my name is Ashley Powell and um, I'm from Broome, Western Australia. Uh, my in-game alias is uh, Trill. I play main tank for the Dallas Hero. He's built another Primal Rage! Exactly the disruption that Australia's needed! And Trill is going to be the difference maker! That's the Nano going on to Trill. It's going to make it very hard to drop a one-man army right now. So I come from a small town in Western Australia called Broome and it's pretty much a small beach town, kind of one of those towns where like everyone knows everyone sort of thing. Like you go out to the shops, you'll see someone you know sort of thing. So it's a very small just like town on the coast. My mom's from Philippines, so I have like Filipino Australian, my dad's Australian and I have an older brother who's 25. So it's pretty much just me, my brother and my two parents. Um, my biggest passion at the time when I was younger was like skateboarding and stuff like that. So like I used to go to the skate park like a bunch. Like I would literally go early to go to the skate park before school and then I would go from the skate park to school and then after the, like school would end I would go straight back to the skate park and then some days like I would like leave the skate park early, I'll just go home and play games. Like that's pretty much what my day was like. There's some, some nice activities, just cleaning up the apartment a bit and then making sure I have some Clean clothes. With me trying to like get into gaming and like thinking about opportunities for it was, it took a while because I sort of just, just played for fun really and just like played competitively but not to the point where I was like outwardly going like searching for teams and stuff like that in Australia. I was like I would just like play at the highest rank on a bunch of like multiple games and like early Overwatch like a team asked me to come play with them and I was just like yeah sure why not sort of thing and then like I eventually jumped really fast from like the worst team in Australia to like the best team in Australia so like when that happened I was kind of like oh maybe I can try something with this. We played in like a bunch of like small tournaments it wasn't a whole lot of prize pool we kind of just did it for fun we just played. There was a one Australian tournament. The prize pool was like ten thousand, which like was huge back then. And we ended up like destroying that tournament. We won, and then um, after that, we got talks from an org who actually like offered us to play in Taiwan for like three months in a tournament with like hundred k prize pool. So like that's when like everyone was like, okay, like do we want to do this? So we had like a big team discussion and stuff like that, and be like, hey, maybe we can actually like make a career out of this and stuff like that. So like eventually like we got on board with that and we played in Taiwan and that's kind of like how my pro career like started to go. So we kind of just like played in this Taiwan tournament a lot. We were placing like top three consistently. Eventually Blizzard like made like another tournament where it was sort of like placing teams to go play into China. And there was like a bunch of Korean teams, like American teams. That's where I met like McGreevy and stuff like that who eventually like got me onto Envy pretty much. So that was like our first big tournament and my first like big tournament in front of like a huge crowd and stuff like that. This is like crazy. Also on top of that World Cup, I participated in like three past World Cups. The 2018 World Cup, I think it was, I had a really solid performance in that. He's built another Primal Rage! Exactly the disruption that Australia's needed and Trill is gonna be the difference maker. I had a lot of eyes on me after that and people were like tweeting about me saying like how insane I was and stuff like that. And um, I was trialling for a lot of American teams and obviously playing from Australia I had to trial on really bad ping. And um, honestly, like I genuinely didn't think I was going to make it when I felt like I was deserving of it. Like I was performing really well, I was doing really well in these scrims and like I was feeling like the most confident I have had like playing the game before. So that kind of hurt because I, I kind of didn't think I was going to make it after believing I would for so long. And then it kind of got to the point where it was like a lot of the openings were closing, right? I genuinely thought I wasn't going to make it to America and I was like really bummed about it. And then like I got a message from the captain of Envy at the time for Overwatch and then it kind of just like skyrocketed from there and I was like so excited when that happened. And I've known about the Envy Org for so long like back when I was younger I'd watch a lot of like Counter-Strike and stuff like that and I was like geez am I really about to play for this like Org? This is this is actually insane. It has been a day of good shatters for Trill. Yeah, so me playing like still pretty consistently well on high ping, I think a lot of teams were like, damn, like if we get this kid on low ping, like what's he gonna be like? That's crazy. So like me playing on like really well on high ping, I think was like a huge eye opener as well. Like, okay, this guy is like, he has what it takes to like 
be professional. You know, getting like the call to be brought up to the field was like such a crazy moment for me. It's a bunch of like players that I knew, like someone knew already. I was like fans of already. I was just like, damn, like I gotta play with these guys. Like there's the OG Envy team, like there's a bunch of like these insane players that I get to like hang out with and I've known about probably the most happiest I've ever been. Like getting that call, it's like damn, it's really happening sort of thing. So playing for the fuel, um, honestly, dream job. This is something I've wanted for a very long time. It's something I've looked forward to in my whole life. Every experience so far has just been so cool with this like Oregon, it's been a great time.